I don't see why everyone has their wand in a knot about the dark arts. It's pushing the boundaries of magic. Good of you to come. My friend, Professor Fig, speaks highly of you and your resourcefulness. He was vague as to details, but mentioned your having tracked down a difficult-to-find book. I wondered if you'd be willing to do a little detective work on my behalf. Of course, Mr. Ollivander. Sounds most up my street. Wonderful. You see, about a century ago, an heirloom applewood wand with a fairy wing core went missing from this very shop. My great aunt suspected a student named Richard Jackdaw. He'd been serving as an assistant here and suddenly vanished. Richard Jackdaw? Like the bird. In fact, he was known to frequent the Hogwarts Owlery. We searched there, of course, but found no wand. We did find a series of statues similar to Jackdaws. I'm certain they're a clue, but I cannot figure out where they lead. Jackdaw was last heard tittering about some pages with a map he'd stolen from Peeves. As you can imagine, the poltergeist was less than helpful. I'll have a look for you. You've certainly given me plenty to go on. Ah, oh, you've brought hope to this old one-maker's heart. Professor Fig was right. You are a remarkable student. Off on another adventure, are we? The statues Mr. Ollivander mentioned must be upstairs amongst the owls. Don't mind me, owls. I'm just here to help a friend. Now, where are those statues? Accio! I recognize those handles. Oh, no statues here. Here's a welcome surprise. Revelio. Accio. I'll take that, thank you. Revelio.
Birds aren't afraid of height. Perhaps I should look a bit higher. Akio! No statues here. Nothing. I'd best keep looking. No statues here. This'll do nicely. Nothing. I'd best keep looking. Here's a welcome surprise. No statues here. Let me also. I'll take that, thank you. It doesn't appear to be connected to the missing pages. Best hang on to it for now. Rebellion. What's happening? Could it be? Has someone solved my puzzle after all these years? Well done indeed. Good news. If you've got something to hide, you found the perfect spot. Richard Jackdaw, at your service. The Richard Jackdaw? So Mr. Ollivander was right. He wants his family wand back. Goodness. I'd forgotten about that wand. I assure you, I don't have it on me. I'm almost certain I dropped it the moment I was beheaded in that cave. Oh, it was sheer folly to follow that map. What map? Ridiculous, really. Found it on some yellowed old pages Peeves had pilfered. Thought I could impress a girl. But that's a story for another day. So, you stole a wand and then followed a map on some pages that you took from Peeves and followed that map to your doom. Odd to hear it all reduced to such absurdity. But yes, why do you care about some old wand? I don't, really. Ollivander does. It's the pages I'm after. Might they be with the wand in the cave? Indeed. Say, here's an idea. Why don't you meet me at the edge of the Forbidden Forest? I'd be happy to show you where to find them. I think I can guess how you died, but who did it to you? I was having a look about when I suddenly sensed a refreshing breeze, after which I felt, well, light-headed. That's all I remember. Hence, if you do visit the cave, be prepared. I can't tell you what for specifically, but you seem a perceptive sort. Beware a light breeze. If that's the only way for me to get those pages, I'll meet you there. If you don't mind the sight of a, well, my decapitated skeleton, the wand and the pages are yours for the taking. <laughs>